In this video, we're going to complete example two, and for the graph below, we're going to find two different spanning trees. All right, now, if I was to color over the graph in red to make a spanning tree, I could quite simply do this, remembering that a spanning tree needs to connect every single vertex and also needs to have no loops, no multiple edges, and no cycles. So here's one here that I've constructed. It connects every single vertex. And I want to redraw it on the diagram in the middle here. So I want to draw it like so. Okay, so I'm going to rub that one out, and I'm going to draw another one, one that's different. Okay, we'll connect A to D, D to G, F, E, C, B this time. So if I draw that on the graph at the right, it would look like this. And we can see when we look at both of them, all the vertices are connected. There are no cycles, there are no loops, and there are no multiple edges. Anyway, that concludes our video on example two. Remember to read the description below for links to work booklets that relate to this video.